My name's Jessica, and I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> this is my first makeup haul. Um, I bought a bunch of stuff, some impulsively, some not, <laughs> but I'm going to show it all to you. So let's see what we got here. Should I start small? So I just got a couple things from ColourPop. I got this Super Shock Shadow in Kelp Me. <laughs> um, it's a coral. It's very bright. I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, that's better. Now you can see more. Um, and it's shimmery. And yeah, that's my kind of color. So I'm excited about that. I also got this pressed pigment from them. I don't think I have any of these. This one's called Keep Scrolling. And it's a lime with... It seems to have a little shimmer in it. So there we go. Matches my headband. Well, there you go. This is bad lighting. I'm sitting down on the floor by my bed because I'm tired. <laughs> it's been a long day. Um, a good day, but a long day. It's my boyfriend's birthday, so he wanted to go to amusement park, go out to eat, and go to Target because he's an impulsive shopper like me. Then I did spend um, my birthday gift card. Um, my relatives gave me a $50 Ulta gift card. So uh, since they were having, uh, they had a coupon and I had some points, I was able to stretch that $50 to four products. I was able to get a hold of the ABH Shadow in Truffle Glitter. Let me take that out so you can see it. I know this isn't my typical shade choice. It's like a, I don't know what to call it. It's like a gold silver brown with sparkles in it. There you go. Now you can see it. Then I got this Tony Moly um, little mini peach. <laughs> this is a cute um, lip balm. It's okay. It's I feel like the special part is that it's shaped like a peach. <laughs> um, it's just okay, but I like the shape and I love peach and it smells like peach. And for some reason, I'm able to use it um, because like I mentioned, I have to be really careful with lip products because of my stomach conditions and, you know, which ones get me sick and stuff. So this one doesn't. I'm not looking a gift horse in the mouth. Then I got two of these. These are Stila uh, Glitter and Glow Eyeshadows. Oops, those are upside down. They're the little white lies ones. Tongue twister. Um, in Lilac Legend and Yellow Tails. Um, I tried to get ones that are not close to things that I have already. So, yeah, no. It, 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 that just looks like nothing. <laughs> Look up some swatches. Um, they're iridescent like that's the point of little white lies they look white in here and then they sparkle and like do a duochrome glittery kind of thing um of course, no surprise that i liked the purple one i liked the mint i like the peach but i have mint and peach um glittery eyeshadows from stila and i didn't care for the pink one the fuchsia one was very close to this one so i decided to go with this one and then, I don't know, I just, I happen to like the yellow one. So, I don't know if you can, nah, not really. Next, next haul, I'll find different lighting. But these, I don't think you're going to be able to tell anyway without swatches. And I'm not ready to open everything yet. Then, oh, I have this box from e.l.f. I had one for, for like posting on a picture on Instagram and tagging them or something. I had won a $25 gift card. And finally, months later, I decided to spend it because I was waiting for free shipping. But then I think I ended up going over the free shipping limit anyway. So um, I bought the e.l.f. Beauty Shield Antioxidant Rich Skin Protection SPF 50 Skin Shielding Primer with universal tint, which it's not a universal tint. It looks too dark on me, but I put it under um, my powder foundation because the SPF 50 really helps me out because obviously <laughs> I burn very easily and very badly. Um, so w during the summer when I like to lay out in the sun, because the sun doesn't love me, but I love the sun, um, I like to wear this. And then I bought 
this one too. This is the same thing but in a moisturizer. So I decided to try it. And then I also bought their new eyeshadow primer. So I'm going to try that out. And I decided to buy a flat brush, a flat eyeshadow brush in hopes that um, I don't know, I haven't found a brush yet that I like for applying shimmer eyeshadows. I like my I like using my finger. And then I bought an angled blush brush, which I probably didn't need because looking at it, it looks a lot like my Avon blush brush, but okay, we'll try it out. <laughs> and then, wait, what the heck is this? Oh, I guess they gave me a little sample of Hello Hydration face cream. Okay. Then I redeemed uh, some points to get the clear brow and lash mascara. Um, I have a clear brow gel. That's all I do to my brows, if I do anything at all. Most of the time, they're just as you see them. That's it. Um, but I had gotten it from Brow Food. It was from the Ipsy um, Gen Beauty convention. It was in the goodie bag, so I use that sometimes. But I figured, try this one out. Then I also redeemed for this um, the Blush and Bronzer Duo, which I know a lot of people talk about. It's like a dupe for like the NARS... <laughs> I don't want to say it. <laughs> but you know which one I'm talking about. It's the Laguna Bronzer and the the blush. <laughs> oh, and then they gave me this um, because I spent over $25, even though I didn't really because I used my gift card. But um, I don't know if I can use this. No, this has coconut oil in it. I'm wary about coconut oil. Um, so that's okay. I plan on giving it to a friend anyway. I'm sure someone, you know, in my circle of friends will enjoy this. It's not for me. Okay, last one. Anastasia Beverly Hills. This one was impulsive. <laughs> so they were having a, I think each one, each single shadow was six dollars and there were a bunch that I wanted to try. So I got Touch of Lilac, which is very pale and is maybe more pink champagne almost, but we'll, we'll see when I actually try it on another time. Surface of the Sun, which Nah, you can't really see it, but it's, it's like an orangey color. Then I got a bone... F <laughs> I'm Italian and I'm going to screw this up. Bon fresco? <laughs> um, it's like a mauve matte, which I wasn't into originally, but I don't know. Then I played with it in the store and I do wear a lot of like purple and lilac, so I figured, eh, try it out. Then I got Macaroon, which is like a shimmery, there we go, that's better, um, like a shimmery mauve purple. Then I got this one called Not Today, there we go, it's like a shimmery plum. I got Star Cobalt, this is the one I'm most excited about, and Prussian Blue, yeah kind of see that. I'm looking over here because it's like kind of the color of my shark comforter. <laughs> and you can see my makeup drawers back there and somehow my mom's penguin blanket is here. We got a lot of a lot going on back here. And then they sent me um, an 8-well eyeshadow uh, pan which it feels very sturdy but um, it's I don't know, I feel like it's too big. Like, you could have fit like another row in there, but whatever. It's a place to keep, you know, the things I bought. And then, so I only bought seven, so they'll go in here. And then I have the one from Ulta, which is on my lap somewhere. Uh, so I can put that in there. Oh, I missed one thing. This is the NYX uh, Glitter Goals Liquid Liner. I got $5 off of this. This one's Zodiac Queen. It's like a gold chartreuse glitter. Um, and the $5 off was for my birthday. Uh, so if you, even if you don't buy anything, you should definitely sign up for makeup loyalty programs because sometimes you get free stuff. Sephora, you definitely do. You get a little birthday gift. 
Ulta, you get a little birthday gift. And then other places, sometimes they'll give you $5 off or they'll give you a $10 off of $35. But at least Sephora and Ulta, those you do get a free birthday gift. And it's good to have the loyalty program set up just in case you decide to buy things. Okay, that's it for today. Happy holidays to everyone. I hope you have a good night. Bye.